Hello students, welcome back to Rosy Maths class. In this video, we are going to solve the two questions given under digit detectives on page number 61, chapter number 3, number play. Let me read out the question to you. After writing numbers from 1 to 100, Dinesh wondered how many times he would have written the digit 7. Among the numbers 1 to 100, how many times will the digit 7 occur? So this is the first part of the question where Dinesh is writing numbers 1 to 100. I have written the numbers 1 to 100 here. You can see 1, 2, 3, 4 and it is still 100. Okay. So Dinesh has written numbers 1 to 100. Now among these numbers, how many times will the digit 7 occur? That we need to find out. If you see here, 7, 17, 27, 37, 47, 57, 67, 77, 87, 97. And if you see the ones place, that is the units place. This is the units place or ones place. 7 occurs 10 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So 10 times it occurs in the ones place. And now if you see the tens place. This is the tens place. Ones, tens, right? Here we have 70, 71, 72 till 79. To find out the tens place, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this is again 10 times, right? So we can write here, in ones place, the digit 7 appears 10 times. And in tens place, again, the digit appears 10 times, right? So in total, it would be 20 times. 20 times. So here we have 10 and here from here till here we have 10. Okay, 10 plus 10, 20. That was the first part of the question and the answer is 20. The second part of the question is among the numbers 1 to 1000, 1 to 1000, how many times will the digit 7 occur? So we saw from 1 to 100 it was 20 times. Now I have written the numbers 101 to 200 and we will check how many times 7 appears here. Okay. So now see here. 101, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So if you see this row, 107 to 197 in one's place, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We are taking this one's place. Okay. 8, 9, 10. So it appears 10 times in ones place. This is ones place. Okay. And now we will see the tens place. So here we see 170. This is tens place. Right. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So again it's 10 and 10. This is tens place. Right. Tens place and ones place. So 10 plus 10, 20. Again it would be 20. So we are going to write this now. 1 to 100. The digit 7 appears between 1 to 100. The digit 7 appears 20 times. Between 101 to 200, again it's 20 times. Now from 201 to 300, it would be 20 times. 301 to 400, 20 times. So we can just go on writing like this. 20, 20. For all these numbers, okay, 20, 20 and then 20. I have written 20 till the end, 901 to 1000. Now, we will see from 601 to 700, 601 to 700. If you go back to the table here, here we will have instead of 200, it will be 700, right? So, 7 is in hundreds place. So, one extra 7 we will have here. 1 extra 7, right? Between 601 and 700, we will have 1 extra 7. So, we are going to write here. See, 601 to 700, 20 plus 1. 20 plus 1. Okay? Now, 701 to 800. Now, let's see this table here. I have written the numbers from 701 to 800. First, we will count the 7 in the 1's place. So, 1... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
okay this doesn't change ones place remains the same now the tens place 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 again tens place we have 10 okay tens place also we have 10 now we will see that hundreds place see it starts from 701 and it's still 799 that means 1 2 3 4 and it's still 99 that means hundreds place it appears 99 times hundreds place it appears 99 times so it's 99 plus 10 plus 10 right so we have already written here 701 to 800 is 20 plus 99 this is going to be plus 99 okay now we are going to add these numbers first we are going to add all the 20s okay so this is 20 40 60 80 100 120 140 160 180 200 okay i have just counted all the 20s and that's 200 and now here we have 99 plus 1 that is 100 so 200 plus 100 and that makes it a total of 300 so we can say therefore the digit 7 appears 300 times 300 times among the numbers 1 to 1000 okay i hope you find this video helpful thank you